I'm Wilder Weir and welcome to The Gamer News, where hacker Gary Bowser has been sentenced to over three years in prison. Bowser was a member of the hacker group Team Executor and was busted back in September 2020 for creating and selling a number of illegal circumvention devices designed to allow players to play illegal ROMs on consoles, including Switch, 3DS, PlayStation Mini, and Super NES Mini. Bowser was a high-level manager and served as a link between the hackers and their customer base. He had already agreed to pay a $4.5 million fine to the U.S. government and a $10 million fine to Nintendo in a separate civil case. But Nintendo wanted him to do the hard time. 40 months is a long time, but significantly less than the five-year sentence the U.S. attorney was gunning for. U.S. Attorney Nick Brown released this statement saying that this piracy scheme is estimated to have caused more than $65 million in losses to video game companies. It's likely the U.S. Attorney's Office is using Bowser to set an example as they haven't been able to catch the rest of Team Executor yet. Nintendo doesn't play around. I'm Wilder Weir for the Gamer News. Thanks for watching.